CCSD has a very rich collaborative culture. It also has a history of cross-disciplinary research efforts. It's really the collision or interaction of those different disciplines, perspectives, ideas that really fosters innovation on our campus. We also provide for our community the opportunity to grow new businesses. When I started working at UCSD as an infectious disease epidemiologist, I learned how big of a problem tuberculosis is in the U.S.-Mexico border region. The treatment for TB takes six months or longer of uh, daily antibiotics and our health departments have to ensure that the patients are actually taking all their medications. So our health department actually would send a uh, DOT worker to a patient's home every day to watch them take their medications. I thought, well, if the interaction is really just intended to make sure that the patient is swallowing their medications, couldn't this be done remotely with mobile phones? The Office of Research Affairs um, played a role in the commercialization of VDOT by helping Richard Garfin, the entrepreneur for the technology, to really find the right resources on campus to help him develop his ideas. The Qualcomm Institute was instrumental in making this project a reality. As an epidemiologist, I have the understanding of the disease and the, uh, how to implement uh, an intervention, but I don't know how to program. We designed the study and, and told them what we needed, and they developed the technology and made it happen. We received funding from the National Institutes of Health to develop a pilot project and in collaboration with the County Health Department, we developed the, the project. We realized that there was definitely a demand for this. Um, but in order to scale up this technology, it would require um, commercialization because we couldn't provide it to the world through research studies. Not knowing anything about business and how to start a business, I figured it made sense to reach out to our partners on campus. Richard didn't know at the time about the wonderful lab to market course at the Rady School of Management, so we were able to connect him to that. Lab to market is a three course capstone program for all Rady MBAs. For those students who uh, have an idea of, of wanting to become a startup entrepreneur, this actually takes them through the, uh, the nuts and bolts of how to do that. I think more importantly though, for most MBA students, what the Lab to Market sequence does is it teaches them how to be entrepreneurial. When I came to the Rady School, I did not have an idea for Lab to Market. I came across VDOT and I thought the, the technology had huge potential to control tuberculosis not only in U.S. but also developing world where this disease is a lot more prevalent. Rocky was one of the two um, MBA students from the Rady School that took this project on as their lab to market project. They were um, incredibly helpful in helping me to understand uh, what are the questions that one would have to ask if they were considering creating a business? After we had finished our NIH-funded pilot study, we um, applied for a grant from the Verizon Foundation and received funding, which then we used and demonstrated that Video Dot works as well in other large cities, including San Francisco, San Diego, and New York City. We've since expanded that out to five counties in California, the UK, and we're continuing to do work with Mexico. The outcome of the project was surprising on a number of levels. The researchers um, actually got a new appreciation for what it takes to, uh, to take a technology or a product that they have developed and, and actually successfully bring that to market. On the other hand, I think the students were surprised at how complex the, uh, the environment that uh, a typical University of California researcher uh, works in. And so I think uh, on, in both cases, both parties to the project were able to gain new understanding uh, and take away valuable learning outcomes. Our faculty, students, and postdocs, what we see is that they want to make things happen and we want to be their partner in making those things happen. So I think that we will continue to forge those strategic partnerships and do startups and work very closely with all of the entities on campus to bring the best innovation platform that we can forward. Mm -hmm.